Howdy fixers. So this is a 91 Ford F-150 and I, correct me if I'm misspoken here, but I think it's an E-4OD. I think that's the, the style of transmission I have here. And so this transmission has been in and out once or twice. The first time it was taken out is because the seal was bad and then they went ahead and they put this one here. This is the wrong seal. Um, the correct seal is this flange seal here. So they replacing it because it's leaking fluid. I guess you can see it's leaking fluid down there. And this is the original seal that was taken out. I didn't take it out, but you see, oh man, I'm trying to find here. There's like a dimple, right? Yeah, let's see, yeah, right there. A dimple where something hit or like, well, the seal just went bad. So I, I heard, put the seal in here, and then I was like, oh, I'm cleaning everything up. I was like, well, all right, let's clean it up. And I find this. This is a part of the bushing, part of your pump housing. So this is a pretty common problem, is that the bushings wear out on the torque converter, as you can see down here. And it doesn't feel like there's anything, but there's, this is really sharp and weird feeling so I don't know if that's part of the wear but in order for to complete this fix I've already dropped the pan the pans clean there's no metal shavings down there but we're gonna have to replace this hydraulic pump pull it out and then possibly replace the torque converter to get all the metal shavings out and clean everything out um, this is a pretty major thing that you want to do because if you don't clean any of the metal shavings like I've shown you like this big thing this is just one piece you could have hundreds of pieces in there or inside your torque converter just making a mess so I'm gonna pull this out whenever I can I, I we still trying to think about money right now because it's it's a little bit of money so we're gonna see what we can do so I couldn't find anybody on YouTube that had a video about bad bushings and I tried looking in here and you can kind of it's hard for me to let you guys see it but you can kind of see in there that it doesn't look right. If I do pull this apart, I will make a separate video and I will show you what's going on. But uh, I hope this is helpful. And uh, hope this is helpful and hope this helps somebody. Uh, if you're thinking about going after this with like an early 90s or late 80s toy or Ford, this could be your issue. Not just a simple seal, which is 10 bucks. You'd have to do a little bit more, which is, I'm assuming this pump's like 150 and the torque converter's another 150, so you're probably looking at a $300 fix, minus having some dude like me do it for you. So, thanks for watching. Have a good one.